Hey guys, your boy is here. This, not doing no video right now, this is just a little short because, guys, the King of the Court event has ended, guys. And you guys can see I got my leaderboard rewards here. I was able to finish bracket one. This King of the Court grind has been really hard. I didn't think I was going to be able to finish at the bracket one because at the beginning of the event, I kept finishing. I kept. Well, from the big, what I'm basically saying is that from the beginning, all right, from the beginning of the event, I kept being at bracket three, and then, and then as I grind and grind, I'm happy I was able to finish at bracket one, which is a dub. So yeah, man. So definitely with this three star MJ, I will be able to max him out much faster. So yeah. So guys, we have this three star money makers MJ. We have the ten money makers collectibles, and we have the Air Force One highs. Now I actually have these shoes already, but. As long as these are for a different team, I don't mind. All right, please. I like these shoes. These are good shoes. All right, they start off with plus two to defending, and I think the guarantee last that is plus two to shoot off dribble. So let's go ahead and see what team these shoes are for. Okay, Sacramento Kings. I'm actually not mad at that. I'm not mad at that because I don't have no shoes for that team. Not mad at that. All right, see you guys. guys. Wait, hold up. <clears throat> Wait, sorry about that. Wait. Okay, so you guys should have just seen that I posted my King of the Court rewards from the previous event. You guys should have seen that I just posted that little video of what I got. But anyways, as I was about to say, hey guys, your boy is here with an NBA 2K mobile video. And in this video, guys, so in this video, guys, we're going to be talking about... The new theme that has dropped into the game, guys. And the new tier that has dropped into the game. But before we get into the new tier, guys, we're going to first talk about the new theme, guys. Wait, no, no, no. We're going to talk about the new tier first, guys. Then we're going to talk about the new theme. And the name of the new tier, guys, is called Aqua Marine. Now, if you guys had remember 2k's tweet they did last week yeah it was yeah it was from i can't remember what day it was last week guys but 2k tweeted it last week said that the new tier oh no wait i remember it was when they revealed the lebron courtside pass card all right it was lebron the courtside pass lebron was the first card that got the aquamarine tier and then 2k said that the aquamarine tier was dropping today so we're going to talk about all these cards, guys. We're going to get into this first. Then we're going to get into the new theme. So guys, Aquamarine tier. Let's go over all the Aquamarine foundation cards. So the lowest Aquamarine foundation card, we have a Jalen Williams. Okay. We have a D. Anthony Melton. Oh, by the way, guys. At first, guys, when I entered, at first, guys, when all this new stuff dropped into the game, I was like, where are the faces of all the players? That's what I was like. But if you guys are having that issue, just update your game, okay? Because there is a new update out. Okay. So, we have D. Anthony Melton. We have a Thomas Bryant. Okay, okay. We got a Cam Reddish. This is one in the Lakers jersey. We have a Joe Ingles. We have Reggie Jackson. We got Bruce Brown. And here goes our first craftable player, guys, which is a Bowl Bowl. Now, I hope they add more. I hope they add more of this guy's cards into the game, guys, because we don't have a lot of Bowl Bowl cards in this game. Let's hope they add more. I might just craft this because they don't have a lot of cards for this guy in the game. So, yeah. Okay, guys. Next pair we have, we have a Marvin Bagley the third. And here goes our next craftable player, guys, which I believe this guy is new to the game. His name is Matthew De La Vidova. I hope I, I hope I got, I think I should have that, I think I should have that last name correctly. De La, De La Vidova. Yeah, I, I should have that pronounced correctly, all right? Next player we have, we have our Aaron Brooks. We have a Isaiah Stewart. We have a Vladi Divac. We have a Max Truss. We have a DeAndre Hunter. We have a Dylan Brooks. Okay. We have a Kevon Looney. We have a Grant Williams. 
Jay Crowder, Miles Turner, Jason Williams, White Chocolate, Marcus Smart, Sam Cassell, Tyson Chandler, Della Schrempf, DeAndre Ayton, Darius Garland, Joe Kim Noah, Draymond Green, Amari Stoudemire, Trey Young, Sean Marion, Matrix, Sam Jones, Drew Holiday, Zach Levine, Killer Clay Thompson, got T Mac, Tracy McGrady, shout out to the real legend. We know that been one of the real's favorite shooting guards to use in this game is Tracy McGrady. Here goes our next craftable player, which is Penny Hardaway. And yes, as the real said it, and I'm gonna say it as well, I hope this guy gets a theme card in this game. Let me tell you something, man. This guy is a beast in this game. And prior to him being a beast, he doesn't get enough cards. That really upsets me. Please, 2K, give us a Penny Hardaway card, 2K. I am begging you, 2K. Please give us a Penny Hardaway card. I am begging. Please. All right. Next player we have, we have a Scottie Pippen. We got a Ray Allen. Okay. And here goes, and I think this guy is our final craftable player, Jerry Lucas. Okay. And, oh, no, this guy should be our final craftable player, a Jason Tatum, the cover athlete of last season of NBA 2K Mobile, the Iceman George Gervin, Steve Nash, haven't seen him in the game in a while, haven't seen him in the game in a while, Dr. J, Julius Irvin, Luka Doncic, Luka Magic, Joel Embiid, Moses Malone, Oscar Robertson, Mr. Big O, Mr. Triple Double, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Oh, yeah, guys. Giannis is our highest tier one. So that is it, guys, for all the Aquamarine Foundation cards. We should have a set card here. The set card is Dr. J. Ooh. I would love this. And obviously, to get that Dr. J, you need all five of the craftable Garnet Foundation cards. So, yeah, guys. So... Yeah, guys, so that's basically it, guys, for this Aquamarine tier. We should have the tourneys. Let me go to the tourneys. Tourneys should be all the way down here. Here goes the tourneys. You guys already know I will have a video out later on this week of me completing this Aquamarine tourneys. So, yeah, man. So, yeah. So, if you guys don't know, for that Aquamarine tier, guys, 2K did announce it in their tweet last week. They said it right here. It says, Aquamarine Foundation and Tourney arrives Monday, which we just saw. It says, include some new faces in the game, which we saw. And it says it right here, guys, that the power requirement for Aquamarine is 305K. All right. So, yeah, guys, and it also says, uh, we already know about this one already, but it says each series an attorney will guarantee an Aquamarine card on first completion, one of each position. All right, so we should know about that part with attorneys already, but basically, if you guys are not in the Aquamarine tier right now, that means you need to upgrade your team, guys, up to 305k. So, so, yeah, man, so... Not that far off. Not that far off from the Garnet here. Okay. So, that is basically it for that. And like I said, guys, I will have a video out later on this week of me completing the Aquamarine tourneys. So, yeah. But nonetheless, let's now get guys into... Let's now get guys into... Oh, wait. <laughs> okay. Let's now get into the new theme, guys, which is called Community Assist. Okay, this is a new theme. We never had this theme in last in last season. All right, let's get to it. So, starting. So, so now let's get into the theme. All right, we have the community assist theme. Now let's start off with the ambers. We no longer start off with dark matters. We now start off with ambers now because of the new tier. So, starting the amber tier, we have a Carlos Boozer. We haven't had this guy in the game in a while. We haven't had this guy... In the, in the game, in a theme in a while. So this is good. And he is a gear master for the Utah Jazz. Our last... No. Mm -mm. 
Why didn't they make him a gear master for Bulls? They should have. If, if they were gonna give this guy a gear master card, they should have let him be for Chicago Bulls. They should have never gave him for Jazz. I, I, we, we don't need no more Jazz gear masters, man. We don't need no more Jazz gear masters. Literally, the first theme of this season has a Jazz gear master, and then in the previous Money Makers theme, we had a Jazz gear master. Enough of the Jazz gear masters already. But anyways, we move on. Our next Amber player, we have a Jalen Rose, who's a gear master for Indiana Pacers, okay? And now we get into Cosmic Jaspers. We have a Dwight Powell. I think this guy is new in this game because I, I don't think I've seen him before. Next player we have, we have a Gary Payton the second, okay? And then now we got an Alex Caruso, okay, okay, okay. Now, and, all right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Too bright, too bright. Okay. So now we're getting to the Plasma Courts tier. We have a Harrison Barnes. We have an Antoine Jameson. Okay. We got a Trey Young. Ice Trey. And now we get into Chaos Diamond. We have a Jarrett Allen. We don't have this guy in themes at all. This guy is a pleasant surprise. We got an Antoine Walker. And we got a Marcus Camby. He's a craftable Chaos Diamond card. Okay. And now we get into Zircons. Now with the new tier, guys, Zircons is no longer in event rewards. So it's just going to be Cobalt and Garnet and that new tier. So yeah, so first player we have, we have a Raja Bell. I am, this guy must be a legend, man. I don't know who this is. I mean, I don't watch real life NBA, so I'm not going to really know a lot of new faces. But this guy, his stats looks really good. You definitely got to boost up that playmaking. That's what you definitely got to boost up for this guy. He got a two in that stat. Next player we have, we have a Karam Butler. All right. And then now our craftable player, we have a Isaiah Thomas, a Zircon Isaiah Thomas. This is a Celtics one, though. All right. And now we get into the Cobalts. First player we have, we have Alonzo Mourning. I, I, li I like these interesting faces in this theme because I don't think Alonzo Mourning has ever been in any other theme before, as I know. Next player we have, we have an Anthony Davis, okay. And then now we got a Jason Kidd. I might, I might, hey, I want to craft this. I want to craft this. I have never used a Jason Kidd card in the game before. And I heard he's a good card in this game. So I might craft this. All right. So, yeah. So now we get into the Garnets. We have a Jason Terry. We have a DeMarcus Cousins. He, this is the Orleans Marcus Cousins. So I think it's him and AD you need to pair up to get that dual ability. And the final card is a Jalen Brown. I haven't seen him in a theme in a while. And now we finally get into the highest tier, guys. Highest tier, Aquamarine. First player we have, we have a Darren Williams. He's another new face in the game. We have a T-Mac, Tracy McGrady. Again, shout out to the real legend. I know that I know that the real love T-Mac cards, which I cannot wrong him because T-Mac is fire in this game. We have a Ray Out. Ugh. Mm -mm. Ew, no. No. I I at least at least he's, at least this card is not free. I'm going to be honest with you, man. I remember the last time. This this is giving me back memories to when we had that player's choice, Ray Allen. And I remember when I did his gameplay, I was so disappointed in him. Unless 2K can change this guy, make him into a better card, I don't ever. I'll, I'll never like a Ray Allen card. But nonetheless, our final card is a Kevin Durant. And this is him in a Warriors jersey. Very interesting. All right. I think that's it for the cards. Yep, that is it. All right, so now let's go over to the Tweet to 2K. So it says that first theme of the new tier, players that won an NBA, yeah, an NBA company assist award. Okay, so it says the first event is, now before I get into this, guys, you guys, the first event is domination. Mm, 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 mm. Now, if you guys saw the tweet, now we were expecting this because if you guys saw the tweet from 2K this morning, 2K released an early tweet this morning saying that the domination event is back. So I was expecting it. Now, I am not fully prepared for it because we had domination in the past 
last season. I Every time we had domination event last season, I always try to play it. I always lose. I am not fully prepared for it this time. All right. However, I know that they said they make some changes to domination. I'm still not in for it. I'm still not in for it. Okay. I'm still, still, like I keep saying it, I am not in for it. I don't know what to say, guys. But nonetheless, that is... that. Unless, unless they make some good changes to Domination, I don't see myself playing it, but it is what it is, guys. Let's get into it. So, Domination is the first event we're going to have this week, and the first play we're going to have for Domination, guys... What the... Like, sorry that I keep turning down my phone, but it's really bright in my eyes. That's why I have to keep turning down the brightness, but yeah, guys. Okay. So, we have Domination for this week. It says that the first player is going to be this Ant this Cobalt Anthony Davis. Like I said, guys, there will no longer be Zircons in events. So, Anthony Davis, Cobalt, this is the first card. This is going to be a W. In my opinion, guys, Anthony Davis is one of the best shooting power forwards in this game. This guy is a beast. As long as you pair this, honestly... Give just give this anti Davis guy his playmaking and then boost up his three point shot and then you're gonna see how good he is. All right, so anti Davis, he's the first card. The second card, guys, is going to be this Jalen Brown. Now this guy, I've used him. I've used him in the past. He's really good. He is really good. However, though, he is slow, so you need to make sure you boost up his playmaking or else when you use him, he's gonna be slow as dirt. So yeah, guys, you're gonna want to make sure you use this Jalen Brown. All right, so, yeah. So, and the final card, guys, for this week is going to be Darren Williams. Now, this is a new face in the game, or I don't know if he is. Yo, for for y'all that played previous seasons, y'all can let me know down in the comments, but this is my first time seeing him. All right, he has some good stats. He has five in shoot-off dribble, five in mid-range, five in three-point shot, five in agility, and five in playmaking. So, he basically has five in all the stats. Of uh, of a guard, so definitely what I'd say to bring up for this guy is defending. He looked like he could be a short guard, so I don't know if bringing up layups and dunks would be a good idea for this guy. I mean, you'll never know. He could just be a slasher. So yeah, so we don't know, man. But for now, guys, I'm gonna say if you're gonna get him and use him, bring up defending. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah. Okay, guys, the next event is Fancy Finals. Makes sense. The last time we had Fancy Finals was back at the Halloween theme. All right. So, yeah, Fancy Finals is not a bad event, okay? So, yeah, so Fancy Finals is the next event, guys. So, the first player for Fancy Finals is going to be Alonzo Morning. Now, I'm actually hyped about this. They've, I don't think they've, they've never put this guy as an event reward in a theme before. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Sorry about that, guys. Drink a little water. But, yeah, they've never, I don't think, yeah, they've never made this guy an event reward. And I don't think they ever put this guy in a theme before. So, this is good. This is good. So, Alonzo Morning. And the next player is this Garnett Jason Terry. He has been a theme before. But this, but this should be the first time they ever have him as an event reward. I've never used him. All right, never used this guy before, so I'm definitely gonna be hyped. And the final player, guys, is going to be Kevin Durant, Slim Reaper, man. This is good. This is good, man. This is really good. And it's a Warriors Durant. This is good. One of the best small forwards in this game. No one can tell me otherwise. No one can say I'm wrong. All right. If I have to rank KD on best small forward, I think I have to put him number three because number one, I put LeBron. Number two, I put Larry Bird. Okay. I know Larry Bird's slow, slow release shot would make you say otherwise about Larry Bird, but he's still a beast of a card. So, yeah, so, yeah, and I put KD at number three for best small forward. You may prove me wrong, but it is what it is, man. So, this is good. So, that is it for the event rewards, and it says that more details on the new and improved domination coming tomorrow. Uh, okay, let's hope, let's hope, let's hope the new and improved domination's good so that's so your boy can play it, all right? 
So, yeah. So, if we go over here to the sets, guys, the card from the sets is going to be KD. I kind of I kind of wish it was Darren Williams. I wish it was Darren Williams that was a set card instead of KD because Darren Williams... Now, I, yeah, I wish it was Darren that was a set card than KD because KD is actually easier to get than Darren. Like, if Enyo 2K don't make that much changes to the domination, then Darren should have been the set card, not KD. But nonetheless, the cards to get for KD is Antoine Jameson, Marcus Camby, Isaiah Thomas... Jason Kidd, and DeMarcus Cousins. So, yeah, guys. So, I think that's about it. You guys already know we got the mini gauntlet here. And with this new tier, it's now going to be Garnet. And that new tier is going to be cards you're going to get. And if we go over to the store, we got a fast break pack with Jalen Brown. Is there anything else? And I believe, yeah, we have the crowd pleaser that has Ray Allen. Okay. I, I, I don't ever want a Ray Allen card again. But, yeah. So, I think that's about it, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's about it. I'll go ahead and end off the video. Ugh, excuse me. I'll go ahead and end off the video right there, guys. But, yeah, man. So, so like you guys saw it in the little video, um, in that little short video, guys. This was the legendary shoes I got. Air Force One highs for Sacramento Kings. I'm actually happy about this. All right. Because first of all, these are a W shoe. They start off the plus two to defending and they end off with plus two to shoot off dribble. And it's for Sacramento Kings. Also good because I actually don't have no shoes at all for Sacramento Kings. So that is good. So I'm going to go ahead, guys, and end off this video. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this. Um, yeah, let me know in the down down in the comments what you guys think of this community assist theme. It's a good theme. I like the card art. Pretty good cards. <sighs> I am not, uh, I don't know what to say about Domination, guys. I have no words. Let's just hope that the, the changes that 2K made, guys, are good. That's all I have to say. But yeah, I'll go ahead and end off the video right there, guys. That is it for the video. Leave a like to the channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Smash that like button. Don't forget to turn on post notifications. So that you guys always get notified whenever new videos drop. So yeah, guys. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Your boy is out.